Our assignment was to create something that would take the boat one side of the pool to the next side and then come back. It had to be like, you have to, it has to contain you and you should be dry. We were allowed to use only duct tape. We could use cardboard and some flotation devices like a pool noodle or like a kickboard and that's it. That's it? That's it, Nothing yeah. Else. I didn't understand how like we could do that. I thought we'd just sink to the bottom immediately. It's cardboard, yeah. The duct tape is yeah. on the bottom so the cardboard won't touch the water. We can use these materials so that we don't make the cardboard to touch the water and make it like uh, float. It would be a good idea to use our legs as a source of power. We didn't have much time to work on things. Like We could only go through the design process two times. I felt that it was really successful because of one tiny thing we did that set us apart from all the other groups is that we used beeswax to coat our boat so our boat wasn't like falling apart in the water and we were able to make it across and back. The only issue was that I didn't have anything to like propel myself forward so they dragged me along the side. Was that allowed? Was that that is not allowed. So that's not in compliance? Yeah. We kind of had to like come up with something quickly. We came up with the duct tape rope. Rowing with a piece of cardboard or paddling, it would shake the boat a lot and it would make it really unstable. On the final day, our rope actually snapped during the test. So we had to like quickly scramble together to figure out a way so that our, the person in the boat could get to the other side of the pool. That's like kind of the design process that we have to constantly go back and make it better and like do it over and over again until we get like the best thing possible. We call that iteration. I've actually never done anything with like engineering before. It's a lot different from my other classes. The structure is completely different. Other classes you have like tests, assessments. Here it's like it judges you on how like you're learning and how you like respond to problems. We eventually ended up with something that worked really well.